Happy New Year, everyone. Justin Cody Warden with Austin American Technology here, and I am with Todd Roundtree, the president and COO of Austin American Technology. And Todd, we got a few friends with us. We do, we do. These are uh, a couple of my little my little girls uh, that come in, and uh, I know you know, but yes. maybe some of our our uh, listeners or followers don't know. But uh, I do foster for the United Yorkie Rescue, so I've got actually a Jersey as a foster that's been with me for about three years. We'll be staying around for a while, and Dixie is our first foster fail after three and a half years of fostering dogs, and uh, so she's a member of the family now. Okay, so you've recently adopted her? Yes. Okay, and how old are these two? Uh, both of them are 13 years old. These are two Yorkies, right? Yep. Yorkshire, Yorkshire, Yorkshire ter Terriers. There you yeah. go, all right. Well, <laughs> these are what all the celebrities are carrying around in their purses. Mm. Well, these two are absolutely adorable. I've had the pleasure of getting to know Jersey over the last few years, but Dixie, man, she... She's a little spunk. She's, she's running all over this place today. Yeah, she's been excited to be here, that's yeah. for sure. We'll see if you can keep her on your lap through this yeah. little video. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, we wanted to come back on. It's been a while since I've gotten you on a video. You've yes. been kind of hard to track down this year. What have you been doing in 2022? Well, you know I really can't tell, oh. tell you all about that. But, uh, <laughs> we'll just say behind the scenes I've been extremely busy. Sure. Um, you know, trying to put some things together that uh, should make for a very exciting 2023. Well, speaking of 2023, we had Apex right around the corner, and I got to walk into some awesome right, news here. that we have secured the booth. Yes. We got a 20 by 20, which is the biggest booth we've had in a while. Yes. And we're sitting here in front of the equipment because we will be bringing this Aqua Rose. We'll be bringing this uh, X30 stencil cleaner. You see this is already on a pallet, so we're getting these things cleaned up and getting ready to ship out. Mm -hmm. But I also heard we're going to have an inline in our booth this year. Yeah, one, maybe two. Two inlines. Yeah, possibly. All right, all right. We'll so two inlines, at least, well, at least one, maybe two inlines. Mm -hmm. We're going to be at booth 3251. It's on uh, Austin American Technology there. So come by and check us out. Uh, but what do we got planned for 2023? Um, I mean, it's going to be a big year, I think. Uh, you know, we're going to try to continue our development like we normally do. Um, you know, trying to make sure that we, we maintain our spot as being the most technologically advanced, um, as well as the most nimble and, uh, you know, organization as far as building equipment and uh, being the forefronter. Forefront runner. Oh, Oops, sorry. <laughs> they might kick me out yeah, of the foundation. No, 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 dog, no dogs were hurt in the <laughs> filming of this. Yeah. No dogs were hurt in the filming of this video. Yeah, uh, so sorry, yeah. Jersey. Well, she probably won't come back to my office anymore. But yeah, we're really excited about 2023. Uh, 2022 was a very fast and busy year. Yes. Uh, we uh, moved a lot of equipment. We made a lot of advances. Mm -hmm. uh, we launched the X30 4.0 IO, uh, the first fully automatic stencil cleaner to incorporate the smart device technology. Yes. Uh, the industry 4.0 movement, we're all excited about that. So you'll be able to see that um, in action or at least it'll have electricity hooked up to it at yes. the show. So yes. you'll be able to see how it operates. Yeah. Uh, we will have the, X, uh, the Aqua Rose 4.0 fully functional. Uh, we moved more bass cleaners this year than we have in years past. So we're very excited about showing off the new technology at the show with the bass cleaner. And of course, having an inline. So uh, this will be our first time in a few years bringing equipment. Of course, last year we didn't bring equipment. The year before that, we were virtual. We were doing right. it here from the demo room. It looked like this. That's true. Exactly. So yeah. I'm very excited about the show this year. It seems like there's going to be a lot of there's a lot of buzz right now about it. So I'm expecting mm -hmm. there's going to be a lot of people there. Yeah, I'm really um, hopeful that it should be back to the same uh, traffic that we've had in years prior. Um, you know, I know you didn't, you haven't had an opportunity to witness that yet. I told you how great the show was um, when you got here, and of course we were virtual, like you said, in 2020, and then or 2021, and then of course when 2022 hit, um, you know, I was still talking it up quite a bit, but uh, we got there, and unfortunately, due to some local restrictions and things like that, I don't think it was quite uh, the show we expected. But uh, definitely, like you said, hearing a lot of buzz for it this year and I think it's going to be a great show. Yeah, I'm excited for it. Well, that's all we got for you today, guys. We're really excited for 2023. Once again, Happy New Year to everyone. We'll see you in a few weeks in San Diego at the Apex uh, IPC show. Come by and check us out, booth 3251. We'll see you there. Thanks.